Hello gamers, how you doing? Welcome back. Welcome back to more Sonic Unleashed. Yes, more Sonic Unleashed indeed. <laughs> how y'all doing? I hope you're all having a good old, good old, uh, wait, what is it today? Is it Tuesday? Is it Tuesday today or is it Friday? I completely forgot. I think it's Tuesday, right? Yes, it is. <laughs> Fucking, fucking brain is fried for real. My fucking brain is fried. Yes, you're here for the start gate. How you doing? Welcome, welcome. Also, by the way, just uh, a little, a little bit of a, I guess, notification announcement. Uh, I was having for some reason like the tipping link, the the link that I use for like tips here on the on the stream was not working at all. I don't know, it just, it just kind of linked to a blank page and it kind of just w worked sometimes and sometimes not. Week three, and I'm taking cold showers now because rigid water burns calories by increasing your heart rate. Oh, nice. <laughs> I've heard that cold showers are pretty good, but I don't know. We don't, we don't like, I don't like it. I don't like cold showers. <laughs> I guess I've been taking colder colder showers now because of the heat wave, but I still do not go without like any, you know, I don't go full full on cold water. I still do like a little bit of a little bit of a mix, you know. Anyways, what I was saying is that I changed the tipping link to Kofi cuz the previous one was not working properly. I think Pablo had a problem like Pablo reported the same thing to me once that the page was just like blank. And it wasn't even loading in the first place. So yeah, I'm probably gonna be switching my alerts from stream elements because I've been having some issues with them lately. But yeah, just just wanted to let you know why there's a coffee link now. <laughs> that's that's coffee's uh, coffee's alerts. Coffee coffee does its own Twitch alerts, so that so that's why there's like the little coffee link there. Lol. Anyways, anyways. We're just gonna get into Sonic Unleashed again. Let's go. Let me just launch the game. Let's just get ready for this. For a world adventure. All right, why is it not capturing? <laughs> why is it not capturing Sonic Unleashed? Hello, please. There we go. <laughs> I played a little bit off stream. I was trying to get like the moon medals, uh, you know, like where you play the same stage, but like it's like, oh, play the same stage and collect a hundred rings, you know, play the same stage and don't get hit. So I was doing some some of that just to grind out some of the medals. Uh, and I got apparently that was kind of a mistake because apparently that, that got me another Amogus half. Uh, and it started a cutscene, but thankfully it seems that we can literally just jump into the cutscene. Then again, I use quotations when I say cutscene because remember, this is like the fucking Sonic visual novel. <laughs> this is the fucking Sonic visual novel with Chip. There it is. <laughs> it's this one. Yes. We got another Amogus tablet fragment. Spagonius next, right, Sonic? Well, what are we waiting for? Oh, that was it. I thought it was going to be more than that. <laughs> So yeah, I went to I went to Apodos and Holoska to do some of the some of the moon moon metal thingies. I guess we have to go to Spagonia now. So let's check that out. The Ophelia Noble. Yeah, some of the extra missions for the day stages are required. Oh, I didn't I didn't know that they were like mandatory. I thought they were just like bonus thingies for for grinding out metals. Baker Street. I want to meet Sherlock Holmes. You boys are certainly busy bees, aren't you? No, I'm a busy hedgehog. There are no bees here. What are you talking about? Watching you is such an inspiration to me. Here's a little something to show my appreciation. All right, well, thank you. Secret soundtracks. Very poggers, very nice. <laughs> Main Street. 
You're looking for an old shrine, huh? You must mean that place on the other side of town. Yeah, the holy shrine is... <laughs> wait, the holy shrine. Is it filled with holes? Oh yeah, there's been some weird things going on in that area. Granddad Ask gave me Begonia, this charm. The most romantic place in Sonic Unleashed because <laughs> France and Italy are the most romantic countries in Europe. Absolutely. We need to have it. Hmm? I shouldn't have? Why not? Just take it. I've got a feeling that you're gonna need it. Uh-oh, bad comma. Dun, 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 dun. What? I did not understand what the fuck. <gasps> Another Among Us! Another Among Us tablet, let's go! I did not understand what they meant by a bad coma. What? I think I just got it. <laughs> Still feel horrible. The professor's worried about The professor's worried about me, but that just makes me feel worse. Well, you should feel bad. You were really mean the other day. She was trying to say karma. Oh, okay. Thank you. <laughs> they were saying, yeah. Oh, okay. So that, that was the joke. Bad karma. Okay. I know we have an old shrine somewhere, but I can't recall where. I seem to be forgetting more and more things as of late. Oh no, the poor guy's got, a, got amnesia. <laughs> it's so weird to navigate this menu because like you would assume, that, like you would assume that if I go up, I would go to the sacred shrine. But no, it takes me to Pickle Lab, and then up takes me to Aqueduct Street, and then up again takes me to Sacred Shrine. Like, what the fuck is this? <laughs> what the fuck is this menu navigation for real? I mean, I guess, I guess they were like really more thinking about you controlling this with a Wii. Oh, also, yeah, I got better. I got a couple texture mods to for the Werehog and Sonic. So they look they look prettier now. They look so much better now. I like I like it. They look more like the their HD counterparts now. That is pretty cool. It's just texture mods, like the models are the same and whatnot, you know. Just 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 little textures. Where's the Amy mod? There isn't one! Can you fucking believe it? I've been looking for it and it doesn't seem to exist. <laughs> There seems to be no Amy mod for the for the Wii version of Unleashed. <laughs> I saw one for the HD version, and even then, I think it only works on emulators. I think you have to like they have words make it in more this convenient. version was intended for the Wii first, so even though you can select areas by analog stick, the idea was to aim with the Wii remote. Yeah, that's that's pretty much what I was saying. It's like I pr I'm pretty sure they they didn't mean for you to be playing with a controller. It was clearly meant to be a point and click thingy for the Wii mode. A point and click adventure, if you will. I really wish they would have kept the title of World Adventure instead of Unleash, but that's just me. Just play the game in Japanese. <laughs> Simple. Just play the game in a language you don't understand. Fucking easy. <laughs> I don't know any Japanese. Honestly, if I knew Japanese, I would. Hello. Hello. Tyrannis, how you doing? Thanks for the follow. Wait, what? How did I? How did I grab things? I forgot. Ah, it's with the R, the right bumper. I see. Okay, never mind. Okay, so I can like kind of grab onto them. No, I want to grab the box. Let me grab the box. <laughs> I 
Ah, oh, fuck. How did I... How did I throw the box? I forgot. God damn it. Oh my god. What was the button to throw the box? Oh, it must be. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry, I forgot what buttons I needed to press. There we go. Can I break these boxes? No. You can't grab... You can't grab the flying monkeys unless you knock them down first. You can only swing. All right, all right, thank you. Oh. Sometimes we'll still get those those big stutters every now and then. Thankfully, they're not common, but they're pretty jarring when they happen. Kagari, did you try to remember the control? <laughs> For real. This is why it was indispensable for me to have, like, the actual Xbox button mappings. I cannot play emulators with, like, with, like, the, the original button prompts, because <laughs> I get really fucking confused. <laughs> I cannot actually end up remembering what buttons are for what. Because it looks like Notre Dame. I sure do love the battle music. I low-key do like it, but I get that it gets, like, very repetitive after a while. It's really not a bad song, it's, it's really just the fact that it gets repeated so much. Wouldn't it have been as bad if they had made, like, you know, two or three tracks for battle music instead of just the one? <laughs> But, I don't want to alarm you, but, Sonic Unleashed Battle Music. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> I fucking love the, <laughs> the Werehog Death sound. It's so good. <laughs> hmm. Alright. Because we have to climb up here. Got an item? Ah shit, I didn't mean to do that. Didn't mean to unleash. I didn't mean to morb. Unleashing the beast inside. Somebody get me through this nightmare. I can't control myself. Someone, if you can see the dark side of me. <laughs> <laughs> it's Morbin time, indeed. By the way, let me know: is, is the game uh, is the game volume too low, or is it all right? Do I need to do I need to up the volume of the game? Oh my god, the camera keeps moving on its own. And now the battle music again. Indeed. Ooh, that was... That was a good combo. Rx301. <laughs> Kiki, hello. How you doing? 
We're playing the Wii version of Sonic Unleashed, Kiki. <laughs> In case you didn't know, there were two different versions of Sonic Unleashed. One is the version for the Xbox and PlayStation, but there was also a version for the PS2 and the Wii that is like completely different. <laughs> It's got like different levels and different mechanics and whatnot. <laughs> it's like the same concept and same story, but it just works. It just works completely different. It is. It is the furry version of Sonic. Yes, it is the furry Sonic. <laughs> I mean, Sonic is already a furry though. Sonic's already a furry, so like, Sonic. Can you grab onto that flying guy? Let's hitch a ride to the other side. Is that his persona? <laughs> that is Sonic's persona. The Sonic when he reaches furry level two. Oh my god. And we have a little little Fair fairy. Warning. When you get to China, you have to fight a monster with a club, and then later, <laughs> a big fat one that vomits skinny pigs. As a kid, I used to call them Caveman and Yo Mama. Oh my god. He's going super fur. Yeah, let's go. Ow. Don't spit at me. Why are they spinning at me? Oh, I needed to wait for this guy to like cross. Right. I've been activating the fucking unleash by accident because I keep forgetting that in this game you don't run by tapping the the trigger, you run by double tapping the stick. <laughs> Which is still very weird and I haven't gotten used to it. No! Oh god damn it! I have to go all the way back! No! <laughs> Okay, I, I think I can get back up here. We don't tolerate furries in the stream. Only scalies allowed. No. We love the furries here. Come on, let me grab you. Oh my god, I almost didn't make the jump. Wow, let's go. Can I start over? <laughs> <laughs> Fucking D rank. What did I get? A B? Oh, okay, it wasn't so it wasn't so bad then. It wasn't so bad. Sonic's just being a, just being a little bitch. We got more werehook points B for <laughs> Attack all up. Dark Gaia's attack power gathers around Sonic. Sonic can now use some of Dark Gaia's power. Wow. Very cool. Very cool. Secret documents. Secret illustration. Nice. Yes, continue playing. I do want, in fact, to continue playing game. Thank you for asking. I was expecting for him to help. No, he, he just howls at the beginning, as you can see now. <laughs> he only does the howl at the very beginning of the stage. <laughs> I think he also howls whenever you go, whenever you release your Morbin power. Your Unleash. Oh, there's still one alive. <laughs> Look at how he runs! Spagonia Knight. Sonic runs along Fran Dilly's rooftops to beat up the Pope, who's actually two dark wizards in a trench coat. What am I missing? Where's the other one? <laughs> there's no more enemies! Oh. Oh, I, I just hadn't triggered them yet. Okay, cool. That is very nice. That's very cool. 
Oh my god. <laughs> More. <laughs> you know, I do gotta say, the, the combat, even though it's very simple, it's got a nice rhythm to it. Because the game forces you to swap the buttons. The game doesn't let you button mash, so you have to engage with the combos in some way or another. This guy, like, just... You, you... That's not fair! You have to return to the stage! You, you motherfucker! Uh, Radical Soda was so mean to this game, my guilty pleasure unleashed. <laughs> this may be a bad game, but it's my bad game. Hey, you know, if, if there's anyone here that is gonna defend bad Sonic games, it's me. I'm gonna be sitting here defending 06 and Lost World. <laughs> I know that they're bad, but I love them. <laughs> so I get you, don't worry. Don't worry about it. Honestly, I'm not even hating this game. I'm really liking it. I'm enjoying it a lot. And like the one thing that I, that we could criticize, for example, the the constant use of the jazz music for the combat is also that's always uh, it's something that also happens on the HD version. So it's not even necessarily a problem with this version of the game. <laughs> Why Sonic Extra Furry? Um, Dr. Eggman uh, fucking I juiced. Six, but I see a lot of good things that came out of it. Yeah. Dr. Eggman extracted the juice out of the, the Chaos Emeralds uh, while Sonic was in his super form and, and unleashed Dark Gaia, which is like a dark being that exists inside of the planet. Uh, and somehow like Dark Gaia's dark energy got linked with Sonic and now Sonic turns into a werewolf at night because reasons. <laughs> That's the best explanation I have. <laughs> I don't really understand myself. <laughs> don't really know myself why that happened, why, why he turns into a werewolf. Dr. Eggman did the Dark Jack thing to Sonic so he could piss on the earth and release Satan. The Dark Jack thing! <laughs> He really did do that. There's no real bad Sonic game. Any that are bad are just, just good comedic content. I don't know, I feel like there are legitimate bad games, but usually those are like the the very early, uh, you know, like Game Gear titles or like Sonic Blast or stuff like that. Those are like the real bad Sonic games. <laughs> I mean, 06 can never beat the allegations of being the worst Sonic game because it was such a massive flop at the time. Not even necessarily in sales, it sold well. I wondered but it was just so get any sleep so poorly the night, even when he's Werehog. Hmm. I don't know, nobody ever seems to sleep in this game. Everyone's just awake all the time. Wow, this level really is an enemy no gauntlet. No bad Sonic games? Sonic 3D Blast would like a word with you. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> you know, there are bad Sonic games, but like the truly bad Sonic games have been like forgotten to time. Can I get here? Hmm. There was probably some way to get up there, but probably missed it. I know the bad Sonic game. Sonic Jam for the TigerGame.com. Sonic 3D Blast has phenomenal music, but goddamn, the gameplay is unbearable. <laughs> 
Sonic 3D Blast do got very good music. Like, so much so that it's it's used on Sonic Speed Simulator. Okay, I guess I gotta go back. Ah, oh, there's a platform now, I see. Fights enemies with epic jazz music. Do you like jazz? You like jazz? For some reason the jumps sometimes do not respond and I'm not sure if that's my controller or if it's the emulation. Fuck. <laughs> okay, that was definitely my fault. <laughs> The best Sonic games are the ones with two soundtracks. <laughs> with two soundtracks? You mean Sonic 3? I guess Sonic CD also falls into that category. Funny how it's not a it's not a thing that has just happened once in the Sonic franchise, you know, releasing a Sonic game that has like two versions of its soundtrack. <laughs> nice, yay! Wow, I rule. <laughs> He's so silly. I love him. <laughs> a rank, let's go, Poggers. I absolutely adore this game, but one thing I don't like about it is the Werehog, the repetitive <laughs> battle music, and the Sun and Moon medals. I think the Sun and Sonic Moon medals CD, are way worse. Japan slash in... USA, and Sonic 3D Blast, Mega Drive slash Saturn. Alright, oh, Sonic 3D Blast also had two soundtracks. <laughs> but yeah, like, the, the, the Sun and Moon medals I think are way worse on the HD version. I'm not sure how bad they're gonna be here, but we'll see. Yes, I do want to continue playing game. A hey, for average. God damn it, I keep getting bullied all the time. <laughs> Secret items. Oh, I can climb faster if I double tap. Oh no, it's just like if you keep holding the thing, he just climbs faster. Okay, never mind. Yeah, I've heard that those the sun and moon medals were really bad in the in the HD version. Like people really complain about that. About how grindy it was. But I haven't heard the same complaints about the Wii version, to be honest, so... I don't think it's gonna be as bad, but only time will tell. Don't give me wrong, I like grinding in games here and there, but it was not handled well. Yeah, it was it was a bit too much. <laughs> the Wii was better. <laughs> I mean the Wii was not a bad console by any means. It was like it was a huge success for a reason. Okay, I think I need to go back and grab that thing first. I didn't see it there, so. Oh no, I see what I have to do. I need to go all the way around. Oh my god, stop. No! Fucking controller, please! <laughs> oh my god. This stage is one of my favorite ones for sure. It is nice, I like it. 
Coco, please. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm having like fucking issues with my controller. <laughs> it's old. It's an old controller, but it's very comfortable. I like it. <laughs> I don't want to stop using it. <laughs> It's like, I've opened it up multiple times in order to fix, like, buttons not registering and whatnot. <laughs> like, this isn't the first time something like this happens. <laughs> it's more than your controller. <laughs> Who's ready to beat up the Pope who's actually two dark wizards in a trench coat? The Pope has two wizards in a trench coat. Amy controller, I need an Amy controller. That's so real, yes. Like, do you guys remember Mirror Sedge? Do you guys remember that game? My controller is Mirror's Edge themed. That's how fucking old my controller is. <laughs> That's how fucking old my controller is. It's a it's a mirror's edge. Oh fuck! <laughs> It's a Mirror's Edge branded controller. <laughs> no! Okay, okay. It's it's we're right here then. We're right here. We're in... I forgot I needed to keep holding the thing in order for wait. Can I grab that thing from here or is it locked? Can't really see. The camera doesn't move. Okay, it's locked. Never mind. Okay, let's just let's just go through here. Let's just go to the top. The parkour game, I loved it so much. Personally, I didn't even like the game that much. <laughs> like, like I was hyped for it. I I I have the game. I played it, and I really like the aesthetic. But I I never actually really ended up liking the game that much. <laughs> but my controller is mirrors mirrors theme edge. The mirrors, mirrors edge theme. The oh, fuck, I'm... <laughs> Mirror, mirrors theme edge. Oh my god. <laughs> what am I even saying? But yeah, my controller was like a mirrors edge themed controller, and it's very comfortable. It's very, very comfortable. It's got a nice texture to it. It's got a very nice ergonomic design. Oh no. Amy becomes my grandpa's lab assistant. I'm not letting the joke of D, so Coco can visit her whenever she likes. Did we miss the first one at the very beginning? <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh my god, I have to go back the whole way. Or is it down here? Oh, okay, it's down here. I was I was so scared. I was so scared for a moment. <laughs> I do not understand how that fucking, like, uppercut doesn't connect to anything. I guess because they're floating, it doesn't connect with them. It just connects to enemies that are touching the ground. Oh, this guy wasn't dead. Never mind. There's a secret back at the start of the stage that you can only access by running across the top of the level. Ooh! Is it an Xbox controller? Yes, it is an Xbox controller. <laughs> I love my Xbox controllers. Do you ever try getting your own custom Coco or Amy controller? Kokoma mm. 15 Kisu. No, I've never actually gotten a custom controller. Hello, how you doing? I'm oh, muchas gracias. <laughs> Thank you for the raid. And thank you for the follow. Thank you for the follow, Jane. We got invader. <laughs> we got raid shadow legends. Oh no. <laughs> thank you all for joining. How y'all doing? Got more werehog points. Let's go. Well, that was a huge run for that one secret item, so. Gracias. <laughs> it's 
espero haya estado bien el resto de tu stream. Hola, hola, personas tan expulsadas de Delims. ¿Qué hacen? Uh, we're playing Sonic Unleashed for the Wii. It's an Xbox 360. Got it on eBay for less than thirty dollars. I really do need a a, a a a better controller, to be honest. Really, really need to get one. <laughs> like my my second favorite one that I keep around is a Switch Pro controller. That is like pink and has little like cat paws all over it. It's pretty cute. Oh my god, this fucking wizard. <laughs> the funny song, it is the funny jazz song. Let's go. <laughs> you wouldn't believe how many official Nintendo, Sonic Nintendo controls I have. S rank? We got an S rank even with the whole like going back to get secret island. <laughs> Let's go. Pog? Hacking poggers? S for stinky. Oh, we got a new thing. You know you can grab dazed enemies, right? Uh yes. I, I often just forget about it, <laughs> to be honest. It's like I know that I can, but I forget to do it in the moment. <laughs> Grab the R. What does it say? Grab with the R button These and press X. enemies are way Rewind. more annoying in this version okay. than the HD. All right. Secret movie twelve. Secret illustration. <gasps> Another Amogus tablet. Well, half of an Amogus tablet, but I have the other half. So now we have a complete Amogus tablet. What do you think about the Dragon Quest slime controller? I have not seen that, <laughs> but it sounds cool. <laughs> Sonic Unleashed from Wii! I didn't realize I loved this game before I bought it. I've been really liking it. I've been really liking it. Hey Sonic, now we have a, some more tablet, more Amogus tablet fragments. Let's go see the professor. Let's go. <gasps> it's a scene with my wife. Yes. It's her. My wife is getting harassed. Fuck. <laughs> is there some kind of party going on? No. Something's not right here. Hey, you creep. She's under 18. <laughs> Leave her alone. Lock at Carrie Bando come out. Oh no. What the fuck is this? <laughs> it's quick time events? What? <laughs> Fucking what? <laughs> QTE. We don't even get to actually fight them. It's a fucking QTE. Did you know what? The professor's assistant is played by Jason Griffith, aka oh Sonic Slash Shadow. Oh my god. Neta no mames, que mamada fue eso. And we see, he swings away like Spider-Man. I love it. Now was that Sonic? It was. That should calm things down a bit around here. Chalk another one up for Sonic. It's the pickle. You know Sonic? Of course. He was here just a moment ago. Tell me what's happened to him, please. Tell me everything you know. I'll happily explain everything. Over a cucumber sandwich. He's pickle Rick. I love how Amy just fucking kidnaps him. <laughs> hey, it's my grandpa. 
What the fuck was that? The QTE was so fucking lame. We didn't even get to fight the actual enemies. Oh my god. <laughs> Menos mal, menos mal no vuelto a hacer eso en los juegos del Switch. Puta madre, real. For real, for real. Imagine, imagine if fucking Switch ports were like this. We're going to the Pickle Lab with Pickle Rick. Sonic. That's the only time that happens in the game, by the way. Wait, for real? It's like literally just one time in the whole game? I don't know if that makes it worse or better, to be honest. For those of you who don't know the context, a lot of the NPCs look like my relatives. <laughs> Sonic, Sonic, even if you change your look, you're still Sonic to me. Oh, she's precious. Sorry that I didn't recognize you right away. Oh. Your quest to open the temple door, the Amogus temple doors, is moving apace, I see. My analysis of available data has uncovered the location of another Amogus temple. The data indicates the next temple is in Chunan. Chunan. As usual, ask the people there about what you need to know. Sonic, time is of the, ens the essence. You must proceed forthwith to Chunan. I'm here to help the professor. Stop by anytime, Sonic. Yay! I'm glad that Amy's in this game. This game immediately is better because Amy is in it. <laughs> it was a funny guy who included me as an NPC in the game. <laughs> you can go to Chunan! My god, Bea was right. There is no Latin America in this map. Latin America doesn't exist in the Sonic universe. That is so sad. <laughs> We're myth. <laughs> we got we got fucking teleported to Tlaxcala. <laughs> Arrow, hello. Thank you for the follow. Appreciate it. How you doing? That's okay. The US doesn't exist in this version of the game either. Oh my god, for real? They skipped that? Creo <laughs> K Latino America San Los Amigos K Asimos en El Camino. Yes, real. The the true Latin America was the friends we made along the way. <laughs> or a flow way. Um. Oh my God. What are what are these? What is this? <laughs> okay. Is is it just me or this looks like a racist caricature? Like holy fucking shit. <laughs> Africa exists, but there's oh only a boss. What? Yeah. You startled me. I was lost in thought. Our village elder is missing. The whole village is in an uproar. <laughs> You'll excuse me. I should join the search. Oh my god. Fucking character designs are wild in this. Okay, this is this is less. This is, less. is it racist if it's a Japanese game? I mean, if they're depicting Chinese people, it may be. <laughs> no, <laughs> don't let the racism be seen. <laughs> Go to Japan, take it down a notch. <laughs> Come to visit the village. Unfortunately, your timing is terrible. With the disappearance of the village, of the village elder, the, uh, the village is a whirlwind of activity. Can I be of help? I mean, it's like, just, just to clarify, I don't think it was like ill, ill intended. <laughs> just, just think that they, I don't know. It's kind of like how Shadow the Hedgehog says disgusting black creatures. <laughs> it's just like an unintended. The HD unintended version is way thing. better with interacting with NPCs. I don't like the flat pings with text bubbles. Yeah, I do not. I do not like this fucking like text adventure. But you know, it's what we get. It's what we get for the Wii. Our fellow seems to have talent for finding trouble. That's how I like my men. Oh my god, the old lady's flirting with us. No, <laughs> Shadow, you can't say that. <laughs> but he did. He says it. <laughs> he says it on his own game. <laughs> Would you kids help out and go find him? You can ask Shuifon for details. Now, if it had the cone hat and slanted eyes, that. <laughs> 
I mean, it could be worse, you're right. How not to fall into serious <laughs> My grandpa is uh, the elder of the village. Shadow the Hedgehog. Friendly fire will not be tolerated. <laughs> He's been gone for a long time and everyone is getting worried. Worrying always makes me hungry. Got anything to eat on you? Uh, no, sadly no. The street bench. Oh, she looks nice. I like her. It must be very hard. It must be very hard on you traveling all over the world. Oh, I can give you this. It'd be it'd be nice if you bump into. It'd be nice if you bump into someone you know. What? Secret soundtrack. Shadow is the worst character. <laughs> Shadow is the worst character to have said that. Yeah. Oh no, Shadow. Why? Why? No, he's here. Let's all let's look elsewhere, Sonic. I like Shadow. I like Shadow too. I like Shadow. Worrying makes him hungry. What a fat ass limo. They just ended your CD. <laughs> There's a cutscene in the HD version where Sonic saves the village elder that isn't in the Wii version for some reason. I mean, there there are so many things in the HD version that are not in the Wii U version. <laughs> in, sorry, in the Wii version. <laughs> so like, I wouldn't, I wouldn't keep score of all the things missing. <laughs> Then again, you know, the Wii version has things that the HD version doesn't have. Like, the the Wii version has more like a, a narrative around the temples. And then like, you know, village elders that are kind of like part of a fucking secret society, <laughs> it seems. <laughs> I really was so worried about the elder. Where could I, where could I, could he have gone? What? You'll have a look for the elder. There's a holy shrine not far from here. What do you mean that again? <laughs> <laughs> All I know is that we've checked elsewhere and we can think of. Thanks for looking for the Elder. Oh, and if you find him, give him this. I'm not sure what it is, but he asked me to hold onto it for him. I'm sure he wants it back. It's another Amogus tablet! Let's go! Wii version has Gaia games, <laughs> HD version sucks. All I asked in life is the Project 06 to be official. And a steam port of Unleashed. Sadly, I saw a tweet today from Project 06 that it's not gonna have the story and hub worlds, which is a bit disappointing, but I kind of saw it coming, so. You know, Chaos X tweeted that today. <laughs> I think he had tweeted it before, so he was like clarifying that, like, you know, just to clarify again, you know, we're not gonna be adding the story and like the, the hub worlds to Project 06. Which is a bit of a shame, to be honest. Then again, I can't complain that much, you know, like all the work they put into Project 06 already is pretty pretty amazing. This must be the this must be the secret of the Mogus Shrine, the villagers we're talking about. We have to find a village elder. Come on, let's go in, Sonic. The Among Us Temple from the Dark Web. It is said that if you enter the Among Us Temple at 3 a.m., you turn into the imposter. <laughs> Sorry, I have Among Us brain rot. <laughs> Sorry, I can't stop. <laughs> well, that was a joke tweet, don't worry. Maybe not the hub worlds, but they might consider the story. That was a joke tweet? The brain rot has taken Coco. <laughs> she is beyond saving. I mean, I really wish it's a joke tweet. A joke tweet. But I'm not sure if it really is a joke. <laughs> Still, you know, even if they just do, like, the actual levels and just give you a menu to play through them, I, I would be perfectly satisfied. I still would be very satisfied with the end result. But we need the trial of love. <laughs> the trial of he love, the, the best part fucking Sonic part of Sonic. Sonic two dark wizards that are actually the Pope.
fight. Secret wall. Algo así me vi cuando salí del psiquiátrico, los enfermeros no me querían de harir. <laughs> I still do not understand how enemies can get dazed or not. Like, I don't understand the rules behind it. It seems to be kind of fucking random to me. Oh, wait. But now I can do that. That's great. I wanted. I wanted to try it out. <laughs> I can you're fucking attack dazes. smash him like the Hulk. Oh, you're right. I forgot about that. That's like a guaranteed daze. Wait, there was something. Here. Got an item. Cool. Why is the game so stingy with lives? We haven't died a single fucking time, and we still just have two lives. Why is the game so stingy with giving us more lives? <laughs> the extra lives are all in the side rooms in Gaia Gate. Oh, okay. This might be a hot take, but I think the HD version has better combat. This one probably. feels way slower, and sometimes it barely connects. I mean, it probably has better combat, it's just like you a lot more elaborate. You can get more lives by completing puzzles in the Gaia Gates. The max oh, okay. amount is 14. I didn't know that, thank you for letting me know. I'll, I'll be sure to try out those. <laughs> you know, at the very least, when platforming as the hedgehog, as a, uh, sorry, as the werehog, we actually get a fucking shadow on, like, the HD version for some reason. <laughs> We actually have a shadow to fucking know where we're gonna land. I don't... Oh my god, what is happening? <laughs> kind of slippery. Kind of slippery. I don't know why the HD version didn't include a shadow. Even if it was just like a circle shadow, you know? Just to know where the fuck you were gonna land. <laughs> <laughs> I love doing that. It's so cool. I am easily amused. Fanboys, how you doing? The HD version has realistic shadows, bad for platforming. Oh, it has like oh okay, so so like your shadow oh, is just projected wherever. In the game that makes me not like it. That there's no fucking drop shadow. Yeah, there's no drop shadow in the HD version. Like, Kate is right, there are realistic shadows, so, so that's why there's no drop shadow. Oh, come on. No, can't grab onto that, that pole. Honestly, the, the combat in this version may be very simple in comparison to the HD version, but I don't think it's bad. Oh, I almost forgot to mention I know this is off topic, but Bloodborne Cart or Nightmare Cart after the rebranding is out now on itch.io, but Steam is apparently stalling on approving the release build. Oh, it's out on itch.io, I didn't know. Thank you for letting me know. That's pretty cool. I'll check it out. I'll probably just get it through itch.io then. <laughs> You fail the coconut, you'll never get the bonus scene winning. No! You know, I, I love those memes whenever a new game comes out and whatnot. It's like, you know, I really like the game, but it was like kind of weird. There was like this fucking three hour sex scene in the middle of the game. <laughs> you know, it's gonna be like that. It's like, oh no, you missed the secret three hour sex scene with Amy and <laughs> Sonic Unleashed. <laughs> 
open it. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe with that lever. With that lever that is conveniently gated off. <laughs> Time to morb! It's kind of kind of lame that you cannot like turn it off to save on it, but it's fine. You missed the sex scene with a squid man in Baldur Escape. <laughs> Fun factoid in Lego Dimensions, if Sonic is playing with Marceline, then he says... If Sonic is playing with Marceline, then he says he you can also turn into turn a werewolf. So this game is canon? Oh yes, we know that it's canon. It's been referenced into other in, in other Sonic games. Even Sonic Frontiers referenced uh, Unleashed. Sonic Frontiers being like the most recent, you know, mainline Sonic game. How the fuck do I get up there? Probably somewhere out here, right? I thought they would try to hide that this ever happened. No. If anything, Sonic Team is always very willing to admit or to like, you know, acknowledge their their previous games, regardless Wait, of quality. Did I miss that? How did Frontiers reference Unleashed? Uh whenever they're looking at like the, the fucking cannons that are like from the ancients. Tails says that oh they were they were preparing like this this thing is like super powerful it must be in part with like dark gaia or something i don't i don't exactly recall how he said it but he mentions dark gaia in terms of like power scaling the thing <laughs> so yes unleash is very much canon oh fuck sorry unleash the is the only very game i think canon. they try to pretend didn't happen is 06 not even that, Sonic 06 is fully represented in Sonic Generations. <laughs> and Mephiles has skins on, on some of the other Sonic mobile games. Mephiles or Mephiles, I don't know how you how you say it. I think it's Mephiles. No, I think I think it actually is Mephiles. But Mephiles does have uh fucking skins. He had a skin for Sonic Runners? I'm pretty sure there's also one for Sonic Forces Speed Battle, but I may be remembering that wrong. So yeah, like, Sonic Team is not afraid to fucking acknowledge the existence of Sonic 06. In fact, the only one that they're kind of, like, embarrassed to acknowledge is Sonic Boom, really. But I feel like that's because it's a, it's a bit more recent. It's a bit more of a recent flop. <laughs> Unleash level reach two. Let's go. We got more morbing power. But yeah, Sonic 06 is canon. Sonic Unleash is canon as well. Everything is canon. There, we have never had a mainline game for Sonic be retconned out of existence, as far as I'm aware. Coco is canon. Yes, Coco is canon as well. <laughs> Unleash! Yes, we're playing Unleash, the Wii version. The best version. <laughs> everything is canon. You know, like, no, even even making the meme aside, even making the I mean, everything Sticks is canon. Is mentioned in Frontiers, so... Oh, you're right! Styx is mentioned in Frontiers. I completely forgot about that. Uh, Styx is also her only appearance outside of Sonic Boom. Uh, it was on the Mario and Sonic Olympic Games for like 2016, I think it was the Sonic the the Rio Olympic Games. Styx appears there on the archery on the archery game. It's a leap cannon. <laughs> I honestly prefer the Xbox version. I know, I know. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I know most people prefer the HD version, but I'm having fun with this Thought one. I suppose technically, even if you consider 06 canon, the time travel aspects kind of make the entire storyline non-canon, since if I remember correctly, they prevent the whole story from happening in the ending. Yes, yes, that is absolutely true. Sonic 06 is a very interesting case in which it's like... Uh, the fact that the story happened means that the story didn't happen at all because everything got erased at, at the end. Ouch, I'm getting fucking my ass whooped here. Uh, 
fuck? Stop moving around. <laughs> I really like the story of Sonic 06. It's, it's kind of a time loop, uh, a time paradox, you know, uh, story, and I like those. I know a lot of people don't like, you know, time travel stories because they get like a bunch of plot holes because it's inevitable to write plot holes into a time travel story. But, you know, I like them. I like it. The, the thing that I really like about Sonic 06 that I always will defend is the story. The story is really cool. I'm looking at you, Karina. <laughs> <laughs> Ow. See, even even Link has done fucking uh, time travel stories, you know, and People no one complains about to the that. Future, and the plot was about time travel. Yeah, it, it, it's really selective. A lot of people have a problem with like time travel, time travel narratives because they always complain about the plot holes. Even Back to the Future, Back to the Future has a lot of people nitpicking about like, oh, but like, this wouldn't have happened because he went to the past and he was in the future and whatnot. God, fuck. <laughs> I see a lot of discussion like that. But I don't know. I feel like it's, it's just part of time if travel. Else, so six is the only one that did the courage to outright kill Sonic. Yeah, actually, Me Mephiles is still the only villain that outright fucking killed Sonic. <laughs> And he just did it himself. <laughs> he got tired of playing the manipulation game with with Silver and Blaze, and he's just like, I'm gonna I'm gonna fucking do it myself. <laughs> the Warhawk screamed out <laughs> Yes. <laughs> Mephiles is still uh, the undisputed just love to most effective bad Lenore. guy. Just play the damn game or watch the damn movie. I liked Jack 2 using time travel not just for a plot device, but also for two whole plot twists. Oh yeah, Jack 2 also also deals with time travel, right? Well, the whole of Jack, Jack and Dexter deals with time travel. I don't know, I feel like people are well, just too harsh on Sonic 06 sometimes. Coco, good night, guys. Good night! Have a good night! Thank you for joining, hope you had a fun time. Yeah, like, I understand that Sonic 06 was, like, super broken and whatnot, but, like, people, like, and those are fair criticisms, but I feel like people just outright deny that Sonic 06 had, like, anything good, anything good to offer, because of the state of the game. So, like, people will pretend that the story was also bad. No, come on! I swear it just doesn't grab sometimes. <laughs> Gotta love the fucking scream whenever he dies. <laughs> Oof. Gotta like press it even before the, the radical shows up. It's kind of weird. I'm absolutely just not coping. I'm definitely not coping. Just... No, you you try. Was I tried to really say your name the last stream. Many modern games <laughs> on release. I tried to say your name on the last stream. I can't. I can't say it. I'm sorry. I don't know what it is. <laughs> I don't know how to say your name. It's like fucking Lovecraftian name. It's unpronounceable by by mere mortals. It's really funny because yeah, you're completely Got to right. Props to Jason for his dedication. Dude was coughing up blood doing that scream as the werehog. <laughs> yes, I've heard. <laughs> like it's really funny how Sonic 06 was ahead of its time in in the in the theme of releasing broken ass games. Oh shit. Sorry, sorry about that. Kinda, we got a, we got a, got a big stutter there.
Ayid Herbs Nizia. <laughs> I don't want to fall here. <laughs> I'm scared. I'm scared. I don't want to fall. Oh my god. Please, Sonic. There we go. Sonic, use the barrel to put away the fire. It's too hot to pass through. <laughs> Do the barrels next to it seem fishy to you? Maybe they've got tuna inside. <laughs> God damn it, Chip. <laughs> oh god. Using Chip as tutorialization in this game is fucking criminal, to be honest, though. This is a because you will go to the impuestos solo you have because. Imagine paying taxes. Cringe. Are you missing Omar Khan? There I don't, I don't know why people hate Omo Chao so much. The yeah, second like release, the wrong version of Sonic 06. I've heard about it, but it's so unlikely, to be honest. We we know that the development of that game was a nightmare. I really doubt that they just released an, an incomplete version by accident. <laughs> the game really just was that fucking incomplete. Ouch. Getting fucking destroyed here. No! I got no lives. Stop! Help! <laughs> oh my god, thank god. forget that I can fucking dodge and block, but it's kind of wonky, to be honest. Oh my god, that was that was close. I was very afraid of dying there. <laughs> wow, it's the end of the stage. Let's go. Nice. Use your furry superpowers. <laughs> it didn't have my unleash gauge. It wasn't filled. S rank, let's go, poggers. You see, I'm that really good at games. Itself sounds absurd, but it could be true for all we know it's happened before. I mean, it really could have been, but at the same time, I don't think they had a way more complete version of the game, like, stored. You know, like, even if it were true, like, how much better would it have been if they released the correct version? I don't think it would have changed much. <laughs> Health level reached two, yay! We got more health. Take illustration. Yes, continue playing. Okay, I wanna go to the one of the Gaia temples to like get more lives. If I can, if the game will let me. <laughs> oh my god, it's the the third warhog in a row. <laughs> We've we've played nothing but Werehog this time around. There's there hasn't been a single Sonic stage. <laughs> it's fucking insane. It's funny because I was talking about this last stream how it's like nothing new that Sonic uh, that Sonic Unleash only had one third of you the game be actual no Sonic stages. The Gaia Gate. Oh. Honestly, releasing the wrong build of a game wouldn't be the weirdest thing I've heard about a game's development. Yeah, that's true. But like, uh, like I was talking about how like it's nothing new for Sonic to just have one third of the game be dedicated to actual Sonic stages. But then I forgot about the most egregious example of this, which was Sonic Adventure. <laughs> Sonic Adventure 2, sorry. It's like one third of the game are Sonic stages, you know, or speed stages, I guess. Because Shadow is also there. <laughs> it's like two thirds of the game are like treasure hunting stages and the mech stages with Tail and Eggman. And they fucking suck. Mostly mostly the mech stages. The, the treasure hunting stages are really not that bad. Especially if you do enable the cheat that allows you to, 
to have the the radar detect all three emerald shards at the same time. Oh my god, I need I need someone to blow on me like that right now. No! 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 <laughs> Rip. Can I, can we leave the stage? Yes, we can leave the stage. Let's go grind. Let's go get some lives cuz I don't want to I don't want to die in the middle of a stage and, and have no lives. Gaia Gate. Yeah, I really like Sonic Adventure too, but it was fucking weird that only like a third of the game are like the speed I stages. I honestly still don't get why that wasn't in the base game of Adventure 2. It was there in Adventure 1. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know why. I don't know why they thought it was going to be an improvement to change the radar that way. You want to warp to the first one from here? Oh, we can warp to... I'd rather play the treasure the hunting stages? stages than the mech shooting stages any day. I literally almost broke my TV because of the mech. Yeah, the fucking mech sucks. The mech absolutely fucking sucks. We just Ooh. All the way to a whole different Gaia gate. Wow. But how do I know which one takes me where? Okay, I'm assuming the snow the snow symbol means Holoska, so not there. Um uh, We got wanna go to Greece, right? To Apotos, so it's probably this one. Gotta go now, the dogs are acting up again. Have fun with the stream. No worries, Kiki, have a good night. Thank you for joining. Oh no, this is Chunan? What? <laughs> this makes no sense. The iconography makes no sense. I guess this one is a Potos then. It had a Greek design. It had a Greek pattern design. Why is that not a Potos? <laughs> this is Spagoni. God fucking damn it. <laughs> Which one is a Potos then? <laughs> is this one a Potos? It, it's fucking wild that they didn't put like some some way to confirm which one was it. There it is. We're in the Apotos one. Amazing. Let's go. Now we can open these but other doors. Open yet, Sonic. Okay. We need 33 total sun medals and 26 moon medals. Fucking hell. That's a lot of medals. Okay, this one is open. Alright, let's check this. Oh my god, it's another werehog stage. God fucking damn it. I swear. I like how Sonic looks slightly uh, darker and less glossy. Yes, I got new textures for for Sonic and the Werehog. I got a couple texture mods for them. Cause, cause yeah, he was looking like super fucking glossy and. I saw for a no door reason. that was open in one of the other ones too. Ah, oh, there pr there probably was. I didn't really check to be honest. I was trying to get to Apotos. I was just trying to get to to Apotos because it's the first one, you know. Oh shit. What the they fuck? really needed to pad the run time for this game, didn't they? Yeah, so it seems. What the fuck do I do? Can I really make that jump that long? No. Nope. Go into the light. Oh. Oh, right, because. You, you only are the werehog. Oh my god. God fucking damn it, sorry. <laughs> god fucking damn it. <laughs> right, I see. Okay, that's a, that's an interesting use of the, of the, you know, werehog changing dynamic. R.I.P. That is pretty cool, actually, not gonna lie. Like having an actual stage where you have to switch between the Werehog and regular Sonic. Main secret soundtrack, wow.
All right. You've collected everything in this area. Okay. Didn't get any lives though. Rip. Oh my god, no. Stop. <laughs> there we go. Now we can... Not every room has lives. Oh, okay, that's... That's fine, I guess. Hmm. So there are only three doors in this temple. And only one of them is open. now. So let's check... The others. Whoa! This room's not like the others, huh? It's all mysterious. <laughs> I should have gotten into this room a lot earlier, it seems. <laughs> um, Which one was Masuri? I think it was this one. Let's check if Masuri has anything open. No, wait, I think Masuri was the orange one. Fuck. Oh, no, never mind. Love this TTS. <laughs> Thank you. How you doing, Donator? Oh, there is an there is one open here. You you were right. You're right, Kate. I have returned. Coco died. <laughs> yes, yes, I did. But it didn't matter because this this stage doesn't seem to count lives, so it's fine. Uh, oh, over here. Okay. Fine. Was just looking at some of your old POS art today. I so wanna do fan art. Aw, oh, thank you. What does this do? Oh. It activates... This? I was referring to China. You fell off the waterfall again, didn't you? Oh, no. No, I didn't. I decided to just, like, uh, end the stage and go check out these, like, puzzle stages to get more lives. But I'm not sure what I need to do in this one. Hmm. There was that button. And I activated the button. But it didn't do anything. And I don't have the light speed dash as the werehog. Like it clearly wants me to get to that that area with the with the light beam. But I have no idea how. How exactly I should get there. Do I just need to, like, run and jump? There's a mod I sent in the Discord to make Unwished's UI similar to its HD counterpart. Oh, I've seen it. I, I honestly don't mind this UI, so I decided to keep it. Plus, the, the more segmented, like, bar kind of makes sense in this game. Hmm... Uh... I don't get it. How do I transform into... Is there no light out there? Oh, there was. Fuck, I'm stupid. <laughs> Sorry, I don't talk much in the server, by the way. You've been busy? Oh, no worries. It's fine. Not everyone needs to just be chatting all the time in the server. I've been doing fine. <laughs> We got another live, let's go! We're just gonna crawl around for a bit. I'm crawling around at the speed of sound. Wow! <laughs> there we go. Ah, fuck. 
daytime Sonic is a little bit harder to control in, the, <laughs> in these like small stages. <laughs> Hmm. Wonder if there's any other place with open open doors. You don't transform if you're crawling. <laughs> Did we just found an exploit? Did we just find the fucking exploit? Lomel. Oh, there is a door open, Pog. Alright, let's see if this one has an extra life for me. <laughs> Probably not very useful. <laughs> yeah. Honestly. <laughs> Doesn't seem very useful yet. Team Secret Mission 1. Head to the sun door at the Apotos Gaia Gate. Ooh, we got another one. Uh huh. All right. So we turn to regular Sonic here. Fuck. Okay, I see. I can't move the box while being transformed. That's why there's an extra box. Let's see. I probably have to move this one somewhere around here. Okay. Not exactly sure how that helped us. Ah, shit. Uh, not sure what the solution here is. Like, is the I solution? Think you need to put the box on that switch. Ah, that could be it. God damn it. It's funny seeing Sonic pick up a box and immediately transform. You need to put that box in a box, then put that box in another box, and then mail that box to yourself. Okay. And when it go. arrives, smash it with a hammer. Damn it, now I can't move that box. Um... Oh, I probably need a box in here at the end. Right from the side? I mean, it could work. But no. <laughs> no, immediately turn back. Okay, that works. That works. Let's go. Now we have to put a box there, so it covers the light. Oh, right, we just need to put it, like, over there. There we go. So now... God, <laughs> God damn it! <laughs> Are we able to make that jump? 
Yes! We did it! <laughs> we are so smart, guys. Oh my god, now how the fuck do I get out of here now? <laughs> ah! I can't jump in between them. Um... There we go. All right. See, Zelda puzzles aren't that hard. <laughs> now we have four whole lives. We have four lives, yeah! Let's go, baby. We're invincible. All right, let's go back to the world map. Go to Chunan. Again. Mm. It was this one, right? We need to get this. Daytime Sonic has his perks. Yeah, absolutely. If anything, I just wish there were more of his stages. I don't mind the Werehog, but it's like so, you know, so one-sided. <laughs> also, weird fact, Aportos is the only Gaia Gate that is Daytime Sonic in the main area. Yeah, funny that, right? Funny how that works. I still can't get over how he fucking spins. <laughs> it's so funny. Yes, I know. More invincible than that pesky Italian plumber. <laughs> Absolutely. If anything, I just wish I had a bit more control over the camera in this. You get absolutely zero control over the camera. No. God damn it. Eric. You're not getting me with that shit again. Oh, come on. What the, what the fuck? No. <laughs> no. Come on. I just spent so much time getting those lives. I remember the Game Grumps play this Daytime and Eric Sonic was laughing takes his ass off. Robots in a single hit, where Hog takes multiple attacks. I'm gonna be honest, I have beef with Aaron because he just like shit talks Sonic all the time. And I don't appreciate that. <laughs> Like, in general, I'm not a fan of, of Gingrums, and, and especially Eren, but... But more so whenever they start fucking shitting on Sonic. Please do the double jump. So I saw a funny reading for one of the Sonic comics. I see why people don't like the sheep. I refuse to remember her name. Lanolin? I don't think she's really that bad. I think... I, God fucking damn it. I feel like people really are making it more of a problem than it really is. I think she's a nice character. She's just really grumpy. I want to, to take things seriously while everyone else is just like joking around. I think the main problem, and I discussed this on a fucking Twitter thread one time, 
is that a lot of the drama in in the IDW yeah, comic. Yeah, a lot of Sonic fans doesn't like Karen, and for good reasons. <laughs> Not to mention how much of an asshole he is. Yeah, exactly. Like, I feel like a lot of the problem with Lanolin is not necessarily a problem with Lanolin, but a problem with the plot devices that they use to create drama. In that, the audience is fully aware of things, the audience is fully aware of who's lying and who's telling the truth, you know, in, in some cases. So you kind of just have to sit there and watch the characters, you know, fight one another over who's telling the truth and whatnot, when you, the audience, already know, and that's kind of frustrating. So it's really frustrating to see Lanolin not believe Silver and Whisper when you, the audience, already know that they are telling the truth, you know? So it's like, but that's not Lanolin's fault. <laughs> that's not the fault of the character itself. <laughs> it's more so the, fa the, the fault of the narrative device. If we were doing some, like, unreliable narrators sort of stuff, like, that would make a little bit more sense. Or, like, it would be less egregious, I think. I can see the two. It's more plot-based than her. But she acts like a bit of a hard-ass from what I've seen. Oh, that, that's, that's true, and that's, like, gonna be... Definitely gonna be up to people's taste, whether they like that or not. Lanolin is basically Shadow. If Shadow was a female and a completely different species. <laughs> it's more like Lanolin is what Shadow used to be before they made Shadow into a fucking high school bully. Like Lan Lanolin is a serious no nonsense kinda kinda character that gets really mad that everyone is not taking things as seriously as her. Then again, this is my read of the whole situation as someone who doesn't actually read the comics. I just I just see wh whenever these discussions appear, people post like three pages of the comic and I read those. <laughs> and that's where I get like my opinions from. That's like I read those three pages, I try to get as much context of what's going on as I can and as far as I can tell, that's my my read of the of the whole situation is not that far off, even though I haven't really read the comics. <laughs> hmm. Alright, how do I get back up now? Ooh, nice. How thoughtful. Sounds like Boom Shadow. Yeah, honestly, Shadow is just like being a fucking high school bully on every single interpretation he has now for some reason. I hate it. They really are turning him into Boom Shadow everywhere. And I hate that. He used to be so cool. Maybe I should read them to keep up. I love the art. Lanolin and Blaze look pretty XD. Yeah, same. Honestly, for I, I mostly <laughs> I mostly do like the art of the IDW comics. More so than the storylines and whatnot. I really just like the the art and their character designs. You know, I fucking love Surge. I love Lanolin. Oof. That was scary for a moment. I also follow the the artist who originally made Lanolin on Twitter. <laughs> and I love the little mini comics that he does of, like, Lanolin. It really just feels like Lanolin is his OC, and I fucking love that. <laughs> My god, these fucking platforms are, like, so precarious. No. <laughs> oh, don't hey, swing. Remember the big guy with the club I warned you about? Here he comes. Oh yeah, you're right. Yeah, you're right. I forgot about this. Like I said before, I've I have watched streams of of the Wii version, Sonic Unleashed. I don't remember like the whole thing by heart, but I recognize some areas. Ah, oh, shit. No! Shadow usually takes things seriously and rather be focused. Ow! And at times can be a hard ass. 
but 9 times out of 10, he's very chill and collected. Come on, dude. I'm fucking pressing dodge! Gotta fucking do the Dark Souls strat, just like circling around the boss. <laughs> this is killing <laughs> you. I I gotta actually learn. How the fuck does this work? Like, oh, you you have to enter the block and then you roll. You can't like immediately just press the two buttons at once and roll. You have to enter block and then roll. Okay, okay, okay. I get it now. Cool. Yeah, it's weird like that. It's fine. It's fine. Just, just thought I could immediately roll, and I was getting, <laughs> I was getting like fucking tilted. About I wonder it. if her bells is constantly ringing every time she moves. That'd be funny. <laughs> but a dead giveaway to her enemies. I, I think the the her bell doesn't actually have like a time to take away your pro the, gamer card. What's the fucking thing inside of the bells? Like the little cert, the little the little thing inside of a bell that actually hits the thing. Her bell doesn't have that. She just has a wisp inside of there. Attack level up. Dark Gaia's power gunners are on Sonic. Sonic can now use more power, more of Dark Gaia's power. Let's go. B for basic. Shut up. Shut up. It's B for best ferret. We got another Mogus tablet. Let's go. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Just fucking lying there. <laughs> Does it say acquisition? I didn't. I didn't notice that. Be for Barrett. Be for Barrett. Oh my God! No, people are gonna think I'm a bear again. Stop! No. <laughs> I still find it so funny that people think that Coco is a bear. <laughs> oh my god, it's a boss. It's an actual boss. What the fuck? Dark Gaia Phoenix? Oh my god. Fucking homing missiles. Maybe her bell is just a prop or something. Or she has a silent bell so she doesn't give away her position, Kokona 15 XD. Yeah, it's kind of what I was saying. Her bell doesn't actually make sound. She's just, she has a, a music wisp inside of her bell. Oh my god, I'm trying to get this as far as, I can, as quick as I can. Should have gone for this one, actually. My mistake. Trying to go up, please. There we go. Ah, oh, can't attack it. It's like the fucking Ender Dragon. It's gonna perch. We can one cycle this motherfucker. No, just. <laughs> My god, we barely did anything. The jazzy boss music. <laughs> it really is kind of jazzy. At the very least, it's different, you know? It's not the same. At the very least, it's a different song. You're beating up his crotch. What a monster, your mouth. <laughs> if only I had brought beds. I need to bring some beds, some cobblestone.
Let's go! Think there's gonna be another one? Yeah, boy! <laughs> He's so proud of himself. <laughs> like, yeah, I did that. I did that. What you gonna do about it? Why does it always go to the, to the one over there? Oh no. I'm not gonna have enough time. Am I? Fuck. Yeah, no. Didn't, didn't get there in time. I'm just a little guy. No, run, 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 run. God damn it, I'm not gonna get there in time again. Compared to the HD, these models seem a lot lifeless, you know. Oh, I need to... I need to hit him twice? Now I need to hit him twice? Fuck. I didn't know that. There we go. Come on, let's go. Perching again. Coco Case say Siento so damn bonita. Aww. <laughs> Feels really nice. Let's go. It's a Wii, what do you expect? Yeah, it's like, you can't expect, like, fucking HD models here. It's a Wii game. I hope comes open again in the future. I got me some ideas, Keck. Aw, thank you. I really need to get back into, like, doing commissions for real. I've been keeping people waiting for a while. Are you gonna answer that door, BTW? <laughs> <laughs> hey, stop that. No, stop that. Fatality. Zeus, your hedgehog son has returned. You go <laughs> when you feel like it. You can't rush or smart like yours. Less than three. There we go. Also, thank you, fam boys. I appreciate that. But yeah, I do I do not want to keep people waiting around like forever for their commissions. Let's go! We did it! We killed the bird! Fuck you, bird! Yeah! It's been 96 years. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> is that a mod for the doorbell sound? No, that's part of the game. <laughs> the doorbell sound is part of the game. The the bottom prompts are the only thing that I modified. Uh oh, that rank C, why? Fucking why? <laughs> that was not that bad. <laughs> Damn. Yeah, the doorbell, the doorbell sounds are part of the game. It also happens on the Xbox version. You need to be faster. Damn! How much faster I need to be? Damn. Fuck. Hmm. How can I thank you? You will always have my deepest gratitude. I came to look into the Holy Shrine, but somehow it seems I lost consciousness. I am Sun Shen, the village elder. Thank you so much for coming to my aid. What's this? You wish to know about the Gaia Temple? Allow me to explain. You've been the keepers of this holy shrine for many generations. Lend me the tablet fragments you have with you. Here you are, a planet tablet, the key to the temple door. Now you can find what lies beyond the planet door. We're going to the Among Us planet, let's go! Yeah, too slow! Yeah, I was too slow, I guess. <laughs> Fucking Sonic running out of breath. 
<laughs> I, I will never get tired of the stretchy arms. I love them. I love Sonic's stretchy arms. The planet tablet to Chan Lan felt unnecessary since Sonic already fought the boss before getting it. <laughs> Yay, we fixed another continent! Third continent has been restored. Let's go. Ooh, we got another cutscene. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, it's the bird! The moment the temple lit up, the beast woke up! It appears he's come back to his senses. I see. I'll bet your job is to, <laughs> to guard the chaos of the <laughs> temple. You must have gone berserk when the emeralds lost their power. Well, I'm glad you're back. Want some chocolate? <laughs> It took the chocolate. You can't give chocolate to birds. It's gonna die. You killed him, Chip. <laughs> Chip, what did you do? You killed God. <laughs> you killed the guardian of the temple, Chip. What have you done? Don't worry, it's Kevin from Up. She likes chocolate. <laughs> I was gonna say, is this a, is this a sandwich cutscene? It is. What's the progress on the dark guy? It's a sandwich cutscene. Let's go. The hyper realistic sandwich. Here I go to the trouble of waking that dark guy a thing up. And it causes me nothing but delays. <laughs> to reach maturity within the planet's core, ergo, it was still incomplete at the time of its awakening. Ergo, it was unable to sustain its own weight upon its release. Ergo, it scattered around the world. <laughs> yeah. I don't want to hear about its weight issues. <laughs> so what if I gave it a bit of a sudden awakening? This is unacceptable. Ergo, this is the repercussion of your hasty actions. What was that? I'm having a bad enough day as it is. First that professor runs off with the Gaia manuscripts, and now the planet's coming back together. That, Doctor, is the result of the power of the Chaos Emeralds, which you discarded along with Sonic. Ergo, another repercussion of your hasty actions. Amazing. Quiet, you junkie! That was all part of my plan, part of the big picture! Where's the fun in having my plan succeed without any challenge? Of course, of course. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, what's the status of the remaining temples of Gaia? Eggman forces have currently secured all locations. God, I love this. <laughs> are nearly complete. That'll take care of Sonic for now, which leaves the problem of Dark Gaia. It's so much for a high age. He's scattered all across the world. Searching conventional wisdom banks for topical advice. The journey of a thousand miles begins with a single step. Slow and steady wins the race. <laughs> a hmm. Isn't there a more efficient way? Some way to Remember when we used to call this robot Ergo because of this cutscene? All oh, right, he didn't have a name until like Sonic Colors, right? <laughs> Oh no, he's using his Microsoft Surface. We're doomed. <laughs> Professor Pickle may have found a new destination for you by now. Alright, let's go visit him at his laboratory in Spagonia. Alright, Tails PNG. Hmm, where's Spagonia? There it is. Oh, 
might be a basic bitch, but I'm not a fan of scratching. I'm not a fan of scratching ground. <laughs> I don't really think anyone is, but I don't know. Maybe there are fans out there. Oh my, the dark guy of Phoenix has appeared. Events are unfolding just as they are outlined in the Gaia Manuscripts. Very interesting. Additional study of the Gaia Manuscripts has yielded new information. Spagonia and Chunan are your next destinations. We are in Spagonia. What do you mean? You will need to consult a local populace for further details. All right, Sonic, time to time is of the essence. Do pick up the pace. I'm trying. I'm trying to be as fast as I can. Everyone's nagging me. So you got the moon tablet from Lucia, hmm? What? You've already gone through the door. You might be chosen once after- what? <laughs> We're chosen ones and if you are, what more do I need to say? Just take this tablet. I'm sure you know by now Lucia and I are Gaia Temple Guardians. It's our job not only to protect the temple, but also to guide the chosen. Find all the Gaia temples and put a cap- <laughs> There's a fucking chosen one prophecy now? What? <laughs> <laughs> Find all the guy attempts to put a cap on dark guy as quick as you can. Let's go. Another Amogus tablet. Let's go. I love the Amogus tablets. The sacred shrine. All right, there's nothing else. Are we finally doing a daytime stage? Are we finally allowed to play a Sonic once again? <laughs> Let's go! Rooftop run, yay! The sacred shrine that chimes when you drop it down. Fuck, I forgot I, I... I drift with Y. My favorite track in the game next to Endless Possibility is Spigonia Day, Rooftop Run. It is really the best song in all of Sonic Unleashed, like this one, the, the rooftop run. Oh, fuck, I needed to boost there, I think. All right. Do you know that you can press the boost button at the end of the countdown to get a fast start? Oh, I forgot about that. You're right. Yes. <laughs> Fucking slammed against a... Hit what? Hello, Sonic. Please move the camera this way. Oh my god. Okay, forget it. Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> Never mind then. Sonic, please go into the wall. That was a bit unintuitive. You kind of have to like hold the analog stick 
in the direction of the wall, not in the direction you want to jump off. The clock tower, let's go. Ah, oh, we already are on A rank. This is such a nice stage. I like it. Fuck, I was really very slow in this one. <laughs> B for boobies. <laughs> Damn. I mean, we could retry it. Yeah, I'm good. Collected one moon medal. B is for bimbo. <laughs> Secret mission two. Right, you know what? Actually, I want to. I want to retry that. I want to retry that stage real quick. And now that you've gotten one Sonic stage, you can get another three hours of Werehog stages. <laughs> God, for real. <laughs> for real. <laughs> it's not even a joke at this point. Okay, I think we're gonna try this one and we're probably gonna end the stream after that. Here we go. Ah, ah, fuck. God damn it. Already, already failed. <laughs> Immediately failed. <laughs> we, gotta, we gotta save a lot of time because apparently the, the timer is pretty tight. I mean, I did waste a bunch of time, let's be honest, but... No! <laughs> Please! I want to get the shortcut! God damn it. Come on. Come on, I jump. <laughs> Stop! I'm, okay, it doesn't. It doesn't really respect where Sonic is looking at. It's respecting where the camera is pointing at whenever you boost. I see. What the fuck? <laughs> I didn't hit the wall there. That was bullshit. That was bullshit. I didn't hit the wall. Okay, you know what? Let's check out the bottom section.
on. We're not gonna do it. We have 10 seconds left. <laughs> God damn it. I think we can get an A rank though. Come on! Stop! <laughs> God damn it! All right. Yes. A rank, nice. Yay! We got another moon medal. <laughs> there we go. There we go. Continue playing now. Yeah. Flat Sonic Simulator. I I slammed against the wall so many times. <laughs> Anyways, we're gonna leave it at that for tonight. So thank you again for joining. Hope you all had fun. Hope you all enjoyed yourselves. I'll be I'll be continuing to stream night, this. Coco. Have a good night, everyone. Yeah, we'll be continuing to stream Sonic and Weeshed on Friday, alright? So have a good have a good night. Love you all. Thank you as always for joining. Thank you, Coco. This was a wonderful time. Oh, thank you, Kate. Appreciate it. And Kalashai, thank you as well, Kalashai, very much for joining as well. Thank you, everyone. Hope you all have a good night. Take care of yourselves, and I'll see you until then. Until Love you all. Until next time, I go back to the grind of pumping iron and ice-cold <laughs> water. Take care, Coco, and I'll hopefully be able to make it Friday. Take care, everyone. Love you all. Bye-bye.